Welcome to one of our Alpha Laval 360 degree service and maintenance videos. With Alpha Laval service, you maximize the reliability and uptime of your equipment. In this video, we will focus on how to replace a service kit in an Alpha Laval agitator with S2 seal using genuine Alpha Laval spare parts. Whenever possible, demount the agitator from the tank before dismantling any parts. How to replace a service kit in an agitator with S2 seal. Start by removing the guards from the lantern. Then move the oil trap ring and the O-rings. Next, remove the prevent valve. Mount the retainer bolt in the hole of the prevent valve to lock the shaft into place. Turn the shaft until the holes align. Then insert the retainer bolt into the holes and tighten the bolt with your hand. Remove the shaft bolt. Then remove the coupling. Dismantle the shaft by mounting the extractor bolt tool. Keep turning the extractor bolt until the shaft is forced from the bearing frame. Carefully remove the shaft and the rotary seal parts. Remove the rotary seal part from the shaft. Then remove the stationary seal part and the O-ring from the mounting flange. Remove the screws and then remove the retainer ring. Lastly, remove the spring and the stationary drive ring. Clean the seal surfaces using alcohol to make sure that they are completely clean prior to seal replacement. Place the rotary seal part into the counter ring without the O-ring to check if the height of the pins is correct. Make sure that the seal part does not rock more than shown here. Remove the rotary seal part. Mount the O-ring on the rotary seal part. Lubricate the O-ring with water to make it slide easily into place. Gently press the rotary seal part into place. Now place the stationary drive ring in the flange. Place the spring ring in the flange. 
mount the retainer ring to the flange. Check the tension of the spring ring. Now place the O-ring on the stationary seal part. Lubricate with water. Then place the stationary seal part on the flange. Check that the taps of the drive ring are properly positioned. Gently press the stationary seal part into place in the flange. Carefully mount the shaft and the rotary seal part into the stationary seal part. Place the O-ring for the oil trap ring on the shaft. Place the oil trap ring on the shaft. Place the last O-ring on the shaft. Gently place the shaft into the bearing frame. Be aware that the pin of the bearing frame has to fit into the keyway on the shaft. Next, mount the couplings on the pins. Mount the shaft bolt. Tighten the shaft bolt while checking that the seal and the O-ring slide properly into position. For the correct torque values, please refer to the instruction manual. Place the O-rings and the oil trap ring into their final positions. Remove the retainer bolt from the bearing frame. Mount the prevent valve. Finally, remount the guards on the lantern. To maintain the Alpha Laval agitator as shown, these tools are required. Always remember to read the instruction manual thoroughly to make sure that you cover all of the maintenance steps. This video only shows you some of the steps. Thank you for watching.